All right, you know, we keep hearing about these happening, a meetup to sell a car, and you know what? It ends up in gunfire, but it's the would-be robber in this case who ends up in the hospital this time. Turnabout, fair play. News Channel 5, Sophie nielsen Colding is live out in the scene. There she is. She's at the scene off Charlotte Pike. Sophie, this happened, uh, obviously, in a Kroger parking lot. Right, they met up in a public place. I guess what that would be robber wasn't counting on was that his victim had a gun on him too, shot that man, and the would be robber, the supposed seller, ran into the Kroger with that gunshot wound. That's where police found him. Actually, they had to take him to Vanderbilt University Medical Center first because he was hurt so badly. Critical condition. It all started with an online ad for this guy selling a car. So this other guy, the victim, the would be buyer, wanted to to possibly buy the car. They met up and that's when the would-be seller pulled a gun on him that started the shootout. Uh, luckily, though, the victim wasn't hurt in all of this. Police now looking to see if that would-be seller, uh, the alleged robber, was working with anyone. They're trying to see if there's anyone else they need to track down. But, you know, this keeps happening. Just a little over two weeks ago, a former police officer who posted an ad for his car, was trying to sell his car, met up with someone at a public parking lot in Cedar Hill. Now that would be buyer was the one who actually pulled out the gun, shot and killed him took right off with his car. They actually were able to track him down. So a lot of police departments say if you're meeting up with someone for an online sale, meet up in the police department parking lot. For now, in West Nashville, Sophie Nelson, Golding News Channel 5.